Hey guys, it was Genius4545 here, back with more Half-Life Let's Play stuff. Okay, we are in the sewers now. Really big sewers. Okay. Obvious switch needs to be obviously turned. Would obviously would fill this place up. Oh, is this? This is. Yes, hi. Surprise! You know, that guy before I was shooting him in the body, if you shoot him in the head, they die really fast. Hello? Anybody here? Oh, I remember this part. I'm come up here, steal this guy's stuff, flip the giant lever here. It's just terrible, like, terrible contraption. Because you gotta have someone up there that's gonna. My grenades definitely don't want to be stuck. You, you you had to have someone that's gonna be up there to hit the switch for you or else you're gonna have to do what I did and like slide down the elevator and that's kind of dumb as fun as it is am I actually hitting them? I can't tell apparently not but yep elevator ride from hell it's raining uh, head crabs nobody likes head crabs that are raining down on you Die, head crab, die. It's like playing baseball, though. Dang it. Oh, jeez, there's a lot of you down here. Oh, God. Oh, God, run. Oh, my God! Did not see that. Probably should have ran down the hallway and turned around. You've got to be joking me. <laughs> you got to be joking me. Really? Was there no auto... There was no autosaves. I thought this game had an autosave function. I believe I've done this before. Oh boy, guys. Um, I guess I will see you guys all the way back at where we just were. Yeah. Bye, guys. Okay, guys. I've made it back to the elevator part that I was at before. And I'm going to be a little bit smarter about this this time. By that I mean, I'm not gonna run in to the giant mass of headcrabs. I am going to run away from the giant mass of headcrabs. I'm gonna try to kill as many that are falling down as I can. If I can actually. The heck? What a hacker. I'm not meant to be there. Die. I wanna kill it. There we go. He was cheating. Okay, yeah, there's still gonna be a big mass of them down there. Oh, hi. Well, that's, that's two that we won't have to deal with. Oh yeah, and also I decided, since there's no auto-save function in here, what I'll mostly probably be doing is saving every time there's a loading screen. But if we get to some point where there's a long time without a loading screen, then I will just go ahead and save whenever I feel like it. I'm going to do my best to not abuse save states. But that's kind of dumb. Because there is a quick save function, which is basically essentially the same thing as... Are you alive? Yes, yes you are. Okay. okay. Almost. I can't believe I died here last time. I wasn't being too smart. Is that all of them? No, they're still alive. No, they're dead. <gasps> I would... <laughs> Oh, I didn't know there was a gap there. Okay, here we go again. Let's try this one more time. I have a better idea, too. Hmm. No. That's not what my idea was. Great. Apparently my idea nearly got me killed. You, you really wish they'd jump at you and just kind of fall into that pit down there. But they never seem to do that. They all slide down the side and actually land places. Oh, yeah. It'd really help if I could kill some before they got down. I'm really bad at timing this stuff. They always hit me. Oh yeah, I'm also gonna try to get up on this platform for once too. There we go. Now I can actually heal. What the heck's hitting me? as many as I can from up here. They all 
seem to be coming to try to get me. Are you not getting me? Gordon Freeman. Okay. Oh. Fight suit. Where'd he go? Oh, uh, fine. I'll jump down and get him. Oh, hi. Something spawned inside of that box. I'll figure out what that is in a second. Once I actually manage to survive. There we go. Didn't even get to break out. Any more living things back here anywhere? No. You know what? I'm not going to chance that. Let's just go over the right way. Oh, hi. Didn't kill them yet. See, that's what threw me off. There's no gap here. But then there's a gap on the other side. It's very hard to see from this angle. Okay. Jump over there. There we go. Okay. Crisis averted. I'll just finally make some progress here. Probably keep my gun out. He's fat. We should put a warning there that says, you know, the weight, the the load that that bridge can hold. Because the bridges in this game seem to be very flimsy. Oh yeah, those things are called full squids. They're very annoying because they spit at you. I didn't think they could shoot that fast. Wasn't expected. And then after I kill all these guys with my super awesome aiming. There's one. Two. Get out from behind the box. Come here. Stop fighting. Here we go. Okay. These things hanging from the ceiling are Barnacles, barnacles, there we go. I was drawing a blank. Uh, oh, right into it. There we go. That was kind of dumb. At least you're able to shoot yourself out. I'm pretty sure in probably Seven Co-op or something, if you got caught by it, one, they were a one-hit kill if you got to the top, and then two, um, you couldn't get yourself out of it, I think. Yeah, yeah, that was it. And so that was really annoying. Because if you got caught, you'd have to count on someone else to break you out. Or die, pretty much. This way. Yep. I never liked this place, because it looks like it's set up to be like a trash compactor or something. Very weirdly shaped trash compactor, but... You always think these walls are going to close in on you or something. They don't, thankfully. And now we have this room. This <clears throat> extremely pointless room. Do they move? Yeah, they do move. I think in the normal Half-Life version, you know what? Sorry, I gotta save here. I'm not taking chances. Okay. But in the normal Half-Life, like, not Source, they don't swing, I'm pretty sure. They were all stationary. There's physics in this game. Maybe more physics in this game than there were in the other game. But, you know, still basically the same thing. And we went through a loading screen, so I will save. And we have made it through that nightmare of a place. Elevator. They have some really big elevators in this game. I mean, you could fit a lot of people in this elevator. <clears throat> Apparently, we're in the offices now. Second floor. More people getting sucked into ceiling. Well, at least the electricity is destroying the head crabs for me. It's really nice of it. Let me in. Or die. Dying works too. Obviously, we're gonna have to go this way. Since the lightning conveniently showed me the way. Now, I'm gonna go in here and get this stuff. As dangerous as this is. Because if you even look at this fan funny, it will just one hit kill you. It looks a lot further away than it actually is. If you go even just a little bit too far out of this thing, it will just completely destroy you. But we're okay. We got everything, thankfully. Let's get the heck out of here. Okay. 
now we can move on into the next area, wherever that is. This way. Here we go. Okay. We're going to come in here and get mad at these guys for not opening the door for me. Get free stuff. Why the... I don't remember it being like that. There's like glass behind the glass? No, that's just the texture. Gotta kill all these roaches. Bye, roaches. Bye. You know what? This will take. Oh, I don't have them anymore. I forget. Die, 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 die. Oh, God. Okay, guys. Uh, I'll just meet you back in that room. We're out of time for this episode, so I'll just see you guys there. Later.